In this video, I would like to show you my favorite top 10 OSINT browser extensions. Hello and welcome to this video. My name is Sat from CyberSudo. Don't forget to like and subscribe and follow me on social media for more content. So let's get started. So the first browser extension that I would like to show you is called search by image and it is a reverse image search browser extension. Once you install it on your Chrome or Firefox browser, you can go and the moment you find an image online, you can right click on it and instead of downloading it or copying the URL and then going to Google images or Bing or Yandex, you can basically go and hover over the extension and then you can see that you can search in Google, Bing, Yandex, Baidu and all of the others um, search engines. For example, if I clicked on Google, it will open this image in Google and see where it's been published. And in this case, we can see that we have seen it on LinkedIn and my website as well. The second browser extension is called Exif Viewer, which will allow you to see if the image has any metadata. So let's do an example. Uh, here I have a sample that I found on GitHub that of an image that has some metadata information and I can just basically right click on it and click on Exif Viewer. And then we will see all the metadata information. For example, the camera model is Nokia 835G. And if we scroll down, we can also see the GPS coordinates. For example, we can open the coordinates in Google Maps or Bing or MapQuest. The third extension that I would like to show you is called Fireshot and it will allow you to take a full screen or full page screenshot of the website that you are visiting. And it's different than a screenshot tool because a screenshot tool will only take a screenshot of the current screen that you're looking at. And this browser extension will allow you or will scroll down um, in the website that you're visiting and will take a full screenshot of the website and it will export it as an image or as a PDF file. So after installing the browser extension on your browser, you can go to a website, for example, to test it out, and you will see the icon of the browser extension right here, right click on it, and then I'm gonna say, in my opinion, or in my case, I'm gonna say, capture entire page. And now it will take a screenshot of the entire page, and I can save it as an image, or as a PDF file, or I can copy it to my clipboard. Now I'm going to focus on website OSINT extensions. And the first extension that I would like to talk about is called Wayback Machine. They have their official website. It's very well known. It will take snapshots of all the websites on the internet. For example, if you want to find the ex-employees of a website, you might go to a previous snapshot using the Wayback Machine and go to their employee pages and find what employees or which employees were employed at that time. So after installing the browser extension, I can click on it and enter the domain name that I want to see its snapshot. I'm gonna say tesla.com and then I'm gonna click on search and it will show me all the snapshots that Tesla had and you can see that we can go 2003 and see how the website looked like uh, in this year. The next browser extension is very, very cool because it will show you a lot of information as well as it will save a lot of time. So when you visit a URL, for example, let's say my website, you can go to the browser extension. Here it is, IP address and domain information and click on it and see where it's hosted. You can see the IP address. You can see that I'm using Cloudflare. I can scroll down and see some more information, see which websites are also hosted on this IP address, see some who is information. I can click on IPv6 or the domain name to find more information. I can find the DNS records, which are also very important. The next browser extension is also a web OSINT uh, browser extension, which will allow you to select an IP or a domain name or a hash and search for it online. So this is also something that is very handy and useful. It will save a lot of time. For example, if we have this IP right here, I can right click on it and then go to the extension and say that this is an IP or a URL, etc. And then I can search for this IP 
in all of these websites. I'm going to say IP info, for example, and here are some information about this IP address. So this is going to save a lot of time. Now, when you are doing a web OSINT, it's very, very important to know which technologies are used in the website, how the website is built and what plugins are installed. So to do this, you can download and install a, a browser extension called Wapalizer, which I think is one of the best. If you went, for example, to my website, you can see that the C CMS is WordPress. You can also see the JavaScript libraries that I use or the website uses. You can see the frameworks, you can see the cookies, emails, you can see the plugins, you can see the CDN, etc. So I think this is a very, very, very useful um, browser extension that will get you a lot of information just by visiting the URL. Shodan is our next browser extension, which is a very, very well known. All you have to do is just install it on your browser and then click on it. And then you'll see the IP address of the website. You'll see uh, which ports are open. You can view more details about the IP or the domain. Now, I know that the video is a little bit long. Bear with me because right now I'm going to show you only two email browser extension, which will allow you to extract email from any website or to find someone's LinkedIn email address. So the first browser extension is Hunter. It's a very well-known email finder. It will allow you to find business email addresses of any uh, company. So you can basically install it on your Chrome browser. It's only available on Chrome and then go to a website, for example, cybersuited.org, click on hunter.io, you will find the email address, the email address that's associated with this website. You can click on sources to find or to see where this email address has been found. The next browser extension is called contact out. It is one of my favorite browser extensions to find not only business email addresses, but also uh, private or personal email addresses. And you can install it on your Chrome browser. It's only available on Chrome and then go to LinkedIn. And then for example, I have this person once you click on contact out uh, icon, you will find here business email address. Sometime you will be able to find some personal email addresses and some previous email addresses and the phone number. So th this depends on what contact out has in its database. Thank you so much. If you are still watching until now, I have a gift for you. All the deleted YouTube videos are right now on my academy. You can access them for free. You don't have to pay anything. There are four videos for now. I hope they don't get uh, more. Um, yeah, enjoy watching the videos. And if you have any comments, any question, please let me know in the comment section and I'll see you in the next video.